This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. A recent clinical trial found that the Pfizer vaccine is possibly 100% effective in children 12 to 15 years old. One more review and approval is needed before that age group is vaccinated. Children's Hospital is jumping on the opportunity to help with an extension of that same trial. The hospital is the only medical system in the state part of the Pfizer trial seeing just how effective the vaccine is in children 6 months to 11 years old. 50 children will be involved in the trial in Nebraska and enrollment will begin in late May, early June. The results of that trial could be available as soon as this fall, with vaccinations possibly beginning for anyone over three months this winter. Nebraska Attorney General Doug Peterson is joining those from Iowa and 44 other states in calling on the sales for fake CDC vaccination cards to stop. They're calling on Twitter, eBay and Shopify to halt these sales. Providers give out legitimate cards when people get the vaccine, but some are using the fake cards to make it look like they're vaccinated when they're not. Nebraska's Attorney General calls the use of a fake card a real health threat. And I'm 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Audra Moore with this weather update. It's been windy throughout our Friday, but we'll start to see that improving as we go through tonight. It's still going to be on the windier side throughout the evening hours and through about midnight or so. But then early, early Saturday morning, the winds finally start to calm down a bit. They'll still be early Saturday morning gusting up to about 15 to 20 miles per hour, though. As we get into that morning time, though, temperatures will still be fairly warm thanks to those strong south winds overnight. Most of us still in about the mid 40s as we kick off Saturday morning. But with fairly light winds and more sunshine throughout the day, we already warm things back up into the mid 60s by lunchtime. And yes, it'll just get warmer for Saturday afternoon. Tonight, though, we do drop back down to about 47 degrees, still on the breezier side, but finally starting to see some improvements there. But overall, should be a fantastic holiday weekend. For your Easter Sunday, temperatures warm to about 81 in the afternoon. It'll still be warm on Monday, but then we start to see rain chances returning next week, and overall temperatures will be slow slowly dropping too. So we go from the low 80s on Monday to mid 60s by the end of next week. It's big cookie combo time. Get my big chocolate chip cookie along with the medium classic combo and the medium one topping pizza for a limited time. Big cookie combo. Godfather's pizza. Do it.